why it's really hot in Texas. As you can see, the heat has been crazy. But I just went to Barnes & Noble with my sister. Holy crap, I have a really bad tan line. Anyways, um, I got these books with my sister. I met the author. Her name is Sharon. She's so cute. She made this book um, out to my kiddos. And... Um, I wanted to show you. Oh my god, my sister's also recording. <laughs> Hold on. Sorry guys. So, anyways. Um, can I, can you show yeah, you got all the, the yours? Well, no, just hand me your books. Okay. And then, so my torn. sister got, so she got torn. And this is about like forbidden love. Here's that. Forbidden romance, yeah. Oh, forbidden romance, whatever. And then... I'm not sure what else she's going to give Neon me. Neon Gods is the first book in this series. Oh, Neon Gods is the first book in this series. That's this is Electric book. Idol. This is the second book. Ooh, I like the feeling of that one. It's like yeah. a silky It's neck. about like Persephone in 80s. This oh, one's Persephone. really good too. Oh my gosh, look at that. That's so cool. Okay, this one is called One Cursed Rose. I started it. It's pretty good. Hence the roses. Oh my gosh, that's so freaking cool. Okay, here you go. What's the Tide one? Uh, I didn't know if it was the second book to Torn, but I don't think it is. But it sounds no. like the same thing. It's a romance tide. book too. And then, and then this is the first book in this series. I don't think she's come out with the second one yet. Filthy Rich Fae. Look. Oh, oh it's fire. It's so cool. Or it looks like fire. Yes, it is fire. It looks like fire. And then I love Jane Austen, so I got Jane. That's serious. Who? Jane Austen. A treasury of Jane Austen's beloved works. Sentence, Sensibility, Pride and Prejudice, Mansfield Park, Emma, Northanger Abbey, Persuasion, Lady Susan. This is a thick book. Um, this is coming off. I don't know. Yeah, it's okay. It's gonna come off. How are you gonna read this? Okay, anyways. <laughs> so, I was saying, I got this book for my kids. Um, the author was there and we had a good chit chat and then I recommended her a book. And then I went on Goodreads and I saw this one. It's called The Midnight Library and it sounds really intriguing. Basically, um, there's a place in limbo, pretty much in limbo, where you don't go to hell or you don't go to heaven, but you go to this library, and then you can fix all your wrongdoings and stuff, so. And then, before the other three books, I got these really cute erasable pens. I know, I shouldn't have, but I did. And then now, the final reveal. So, Barnes & Noble does this thing where it's a blind date. You don't know the title of the book, you don't know the author, you don't know nothing. It just tells you three points and like the genre and whatever. I and chose that one. My sister chose fiction, this fiction one. So this one's fantasy. Um, it's a magical oh, island, out. found family, and an orphanage. This one, the one my sister picked, it's um, interwoven lives. Uh, what's with the box? What would you do if you knew when you'd die? So that's that one. And then this one is mystery. It's domestic suspense, new wife, or interpreter? Interkeeper? I don't know. And secrets. So there's that. So I'm going to open these right now. I'm going to do the magical island first because that's the one I've been curious about. The house in the the house in the cerulean sea. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> the house in the cerulean sea. Hmm. Anyways, that one. They said these are really really good books. So. Open my next. Okay, my sister wants me to open the fiction one. The one that she just opened, we both chose, by the way. Okay. Oh, it's a New York best or New York Times bestseller. Um, 
the measure monthly pick. Oh. Interesting. Okay. Yes. And then the last one is the mystery. This was the cheapest out of all of them. <laughs> Why? The younger wife. Oh my god! I knew it! She changes everything. I knew it. It was gonna be like that in this domestic suspense. But guys, can I read them the back of this? No. Oh, it's really good. I know, but I'm trying to okay. keep it short and simple. Uh, Anyways, okay. if you guys want to read this, you can go and look it up. No, they can look it up online and read the synopsis or something. Okay. So the measure by Nikki something. Hold on. Nikki, what's her last name? Hello? Nikki Ehrlich. And then The Younger Wife is by Sally Hepworth. This one. And then the other one, The House in the Cerulean Sea is by TJ Klune. So, oh, and then The Midnight, oops, The Midnight Library is by um, Matt, Matt Haig. The new novel by Matt Haig, The Life Impossible. Hmm. Anyways, those are all my books, guys. I'm going to be reading this. <sighs> I'm really full. I had food. Lots of food. Too much food. Okay, I got to go. Thank you. Bye.